everyone, how's it going? So just yesterday I found out that Affinity Designer is able to export your illustrations in a way that can be read by animation software like Spine in case of this video. So I'm going to show you a little bit on how to do it. It's pretty easy. If you have any questions, don't forget to leave your comment below and I'll reply to them as soon as I can. So I came up with this background and this character here. And this character is supposed to be animated for the game. And so the animator actually needs this character to be divided up into different pieces so he can animate it properly using Spine. This is what you have to do. Like I have this character here. I have to... Let me ungroup it. Yeah. So I have to divide it up into pieces. Like so. Like I need this hand to be independent. Also the years. Separate this eye from the eyebrow. You create different groups for for every single piece. So this is what it's gonna look like. You have every single piece on a different layer. See? Every single piece that you want to be animated independently from one another. Okay, now is the easy part. Now all you have to do is you go to the export persona, you using the slice selection tool here, you select your whole illustration, your whole character, then you right click it and choose create slice. So it's gonna create a PNG file for every single group that you have. For every eye, eyebrow, the mouth, every ear, and so on. Now you, you just go to the slices panel. If it's not showing up for you, you can come here to view, studio, and check slices here. Okay? After that, all you have to do is go to batch builder and pick spine JSON. Then you hit export slices. And this is the end result. You have the JSON file, spine JSON file, and all the PNGs for your character ready to be imported into spine and start actually animating the character. And that's it. So I'm gonna leave you guys with the time-lapse video of my friend Nemo animating this character. Uh, it's gonna show you a little bit on how he goes about rigging the character and actually animating it. By the way, check out his Instagram account. I'm gonna leave the link in the description below. Make sure to check it out. And that's it for now. Bye-bye. Cheers. Take care.